Hello everybody and welcome to a not Cars 3 review. Today we'll be reviewing something from Cars 1, Dynaco Lightning McQueen. So, let me tell you how I got this guy, as normal. So, my teacher, Miss Brenda, said, Every time in school, when I'm at school, I need to tell her five things I learned today and she'll give me a car. So Miss Brenda had to leave early today. So she had a bunch of cars. She had Dynaco Chick Hicks, Flo. She basically had like a bunch of cars. You guys understanding me yet? Sorry about that. So Miss Brenda said every time I tell her five things, Miss Brenda said I can get myself a car. And next time I go to school, I think in Rust. Uh, Radiator Springs, Lightning McQueen. Nothing Cars 3 in there, just Cars 1. I'm like, eh, what's wrong with it? I mean, come on, at least I get new cars. So now, anybody who watched Cars 1 will remember this guy. He appeared at the first Cars movie, obviously. Lightning McQueen, I mean the king, was talking to Lightning and um, just talking to Lightning, saying, you need to let your crew chief do their job. And Lightning was like, what? No, 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 dude, it, I got it. Good team, yeah. So Lightning McQueen was dreaming he was as Dynaco. And, well, that was it. He also dreamed that Chick Hicks got Dynaco, and I don't remember... Oh, now I remember the third dream. Never mind. Even though the third dream Lightning McQueen had about Dynaco, actually, he didn't get the sponsor. Frank did after killing Chick Hicks, which was pretty fun to watch. Won't lie. I'm just kidding. So, obviously, that's where he appeared. I was also looking at this car. And I thought the Thunderbolt and the 95 were face down way too far. I was like, this is a factory year? They're like slanted. So, there's this series, apparently, at Walmart called, like, Boxes. RC Cars 5 reviewed all six of them. All six. Also, speaking of RC Cars 5, um, who was he? RC Cars 5, if you watch this video, I have to tell you a mistake you made. RC Cars 5, you reviewed the Desert Race 11 pack on Thursday, I think, July 4th, 2017. And RC Cars, RC Cars 5, when you watch this video, I have to tell you a mistake. So, RC Cars 5 reviewed the Desert Race 11 pack. But RC Cars 5 made a mistake. Go check out RC Cars 5. He's a really cool YouTuber. All his videos are amazing. Go check him out. So, anyways. <clears throat> so, RC Cars 5 gave a description of some of the cars, yet RC Cars 5 said the Rev and Go Racer, who is currently unnamed at the time, yet sadly... RC Cars 5 said the next generation toe cap racer. Sorry to tell you this, but go check out RC, Car RC Cars 5 video on the um, Desert Race 11 pack. Look in the description, look for the Rev and Go racer, and it'll say the next generation toe cap. I wasn't blind, I literally saw a toe cap. If I had internet right now, I would even show you guys right now that I'm not joking. I swear I saw a toe cap. So our, everybody makes mistakes, you know. You, life doesn't go the way you expect it. As a baby, you think you're going to become a nice, famous race car driver? You you may make it as a famous race car driver. But the thing is, what if you crash? What if somebody comes and replaces you? What if you can't win? You want it to be successful. Win. There's a little fruit fly clawing. Can I see it in the camera? No? Where is it? There it is. Dude, don't be doing that. I almost got you. 
and it's gone. Not really. Okay. So RC Cars 5, yeah, you made a mistake. It's okay. I guess you were typing a lot, so. You know, RC Cars 5 is in high school. You know, high school, he had tons of homework. And besides, RC Cars 5 reviewed Big Fan, and he didn't upload a video, like, forever. I was like, did something happen to him? Then he said, RC Cars 5 reviewed the next generation Mood Springs Racer. He said that school was making it tough. So, lucky to hear nothing happened. It's just boring school. <clears throat> so anyways, let's get into the review of this guy straight off the bat. So let's see. He has the silver rims variation. I think there's a gold rim variation of him. But I have the silver rims with the piston cup engraved. His thunderbolt fades from blue to white. His 95 starts from blue to white as well. The wheels are all the same. On the back, Lightning McQueen is still not a rookie, apparently. Number 95. Dynico. Spoiler. I guess I got the version with Dynico on the spoiler and on the back. 95 again. Same thing. He has no sponsors, so how can he race without them? He has the normal cars one expression, but he's looking to the right. So anyways, there's another version of Lightning of Dynaco Lightning McQueen, I think with gold rims. Dynaco Lightning McQueen was also released in a like different variation. See? Lightning McQueen is blue over here, and on the other side he's red. I or uh, Lightning McQueen is blue on this side, red down here. So that would be a pretty cool car to get. I wish I had that version, but then it'd be like, nah. One has the cool pretty rims, and the other just has the boring red ones. And now, sadly, the Cars 1 racer, Strip Weathers, got replaced by Lightning McQueen somehow. He was going to retire anyways. He was like, I'm going to, I'm done with racing, you know. I'm just going to retire. And now let's look at the Cars 3 Dynaco Racer. Cruz Ramirez. You can check my review out in my channel. Just, just search up my channel. Look at Dynaco Cruz Ramirez review and watch my review. It was quite cool. So, she became the Dynaco Racer in Cars 3, obviously. Cal Weathers was retired, and there no other racer wanted to race for Dynaco. They were like, I bet Tex Dynaco was like, Excuse me, you want to race for Dynaco? No, I have work. Oh, man. And for weeks and weeks and weeks, they just couldn't find anybody. So, that is totally okay. Oh, I forgot something. Really? Really? He has the Dynaco logo. All blue completely. The headlights are still the same. He may have a few scratches on him. Some dents. Some paint is missing, but I don't care. The car itself looks pretty good, don't you guys think? You can see some of the scratches. Like on the Thunderbolt. But I don't care. The car itself is pretty good. So, yeah. Cruz became the Dynaco Racer in Cars 3. Look at them together. Don't they look awesome? There we go. Like this video if they look awesome right here. You can dislike this video if you want to. You're not doing anything. What are like, I don't like this video. And YouTube says, you dislike this video? I don't care. If you guys don't like the video, that's fine with me. But, uh, but something. Why do people watch videos of stuff they don't like? Honestly. Like, if you're watching a video and then you're like, I don't like this one. Why are you watching it then if you don't like it? Vi people try really hard to make their YouTube videos 
like awesome i try to make my youtube videos fun for you guys so you can do it rc cars 5 has over a thousand subscribers and when i get to a million subscribers i'm gonna get a gold play button and this guy i'm gonna tape to him <laughs> i'm just kidding but when i get a play button i'm just gonna like set it up like somewhere in my room, I'm gonna look at it every night and tell myself, man, started my YouTube channel in 2017. Up till now, I can't believe I reached that many subscribers. But it depends. You guys wanna subscribe? Subscribe. I can't stop you. I think I can block people. Like if you guys subscribe or make nasty comments on my videos, I think I can actually block you. So you guys are like, this guy like sucks. He does he talks about other people's YouTube channels like who cares if they made a mistake? Then make all the comments you want. But I blocked you. So you guys were gonna have to excuse me on this one. This is Cal Weathers. I made him the Apple Racer and made a mistake. This is supposed to be the Apple logo, not the actual thing. So Cal Weathers is the Cars 3 stock car. I know there's no next gen, but, you know. Other people, we just don't care, you know. Sorry. <clears throat> this video's been 11 minutes so far. But so far, YouTube has made my videos, like, upload very faster. So thank you, YouTube. Applause for them. Thank you, YouTube, for making my videos just take, like, one minute to upload when they're, like, 12 minutes long. Thank you, YouTube. And my brother and sister are just playing. We're going over my dad's house. And at my dad's house, they have internet. So I can hopefully have videos out for you guys. So I colored over Cal with some eyeliner and stuff. I even left some markers at my dad's house, so I'm going to get to color again. Feel lucky for the Piston Cup. Right, you guys, I guess that's going to be it for the video. Cars 3 stock car, Cars 3 next gen, Cars 1. I don't know what to call Light Blue Queen for Cars 1. Anyways, guys, I really hope you enjoyed this review nonetheless. And by the way, get Dynaco Light Blue Queen for yourself. They might not have it at Walmart because, you know... There was a version at Walmart, like, I went to Walmart to go get some Cars 3 cars. There were, let me show you. Let me just tell you one thing. So I was at Walmart looking through some of the boxes. I found, I found him on a picture. And sadly, when I opened the box, it was taped closed with no car in it. I was like, somebody stole it. I mean, obviously, someone had to have stolen it, right? Why would they leave the box there? It is empty. Oh, well. Pro nobody probably stole it. It probably just fell out or something. But they just left the box there. I was looking for this guy, and I find him. I find his picture on the card. I opened the box that's taped, kind of. I just like pulled it open and it was, the car was gone. So anyways guys, I really hope you enjoyed this review today. The Cars 3, the whole remake, I'm doing the full movie of Cars 3, so hope you guys will enjoy that. Cars 3 is already out on digital and everybody knows Cars 3 happened. So now that Cars 3 is out on DVD and Blu-ray, why can't I do the whole movie? If you guys want me to do the whole Cars 3 movie, don't worry. I've tried so hard, but... When you're trying to remake a movie, Cars 3 is an hour, 34 minutes, and 7 seconds. But the movie... the I'm watching the movie on a site, and the volume goes out for like the last 4 seconds. So, yeah, I guess I'm going to cut off 4 seconds. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this review. Subscribe, comment, and like it. Every like I get is another step to happiness. Bye, guys.
Love you.